Previously on Transformers Rescue Bots. I believe we have uncovered a time machine. Sending alien robots and two children decades into the past? What could possibly go wrong? Well, I'm sure everyone safely arrived in 1939. Why is he here? Dr. Morocco? Warning! We are programmed for defense when threatened. And we are equipped with giant electromagnets. <laughs> You'll have to find a way to override the... <gasps> you do talk! All of you! I didn't say anything. Time to pull these behemoths apart. Leave them alone! Oh, what? We have to get back to Griffin Rock. Our Griffin Rock. Dad, we're home! I don't think we are home. Unauthorized visitors to Moropolis, identify yourselves. Moropolis? A routine patrol with four bats and stasis. He's like a poke in the strangest of places. Earth was their home now, and in addition, Optimus Prime gave them this mission. Not Decepticons, Morbots. Dr. Morocco's version of us. What did Morocco do to Griffin Rock? Whatever it was, we have to undo it. Bumblebee and I will fend off these Morbots. The rest of you, seek answers. Two against five. Maybe I should... Heatwave, lead your team. We'll find you. Halt or be immobilized. They seem to be moving on. I'm glad the stage was still here. Everything else is so different. I wonder... Dad, come in. Cade, Graham, Danny, are you there? Anybody? My dad's phone number doesn't even exist. What happened to our families? The Griffin Rock we knew is history. So? It'll be documented. At the Hall of Inspiration. Clear. Looks like the hall doesn't see many visitors. Where's the holographic host? President Arthur, are you... Ah! But... <clears throat> Do you mind? Why are you all here? There's no mandatory tour scheduled. We're new to Griffin... I mean, Moropolis. And I wanted to know about the town's early years. <clears throat> well... In 1649, the first settlers arrived. Many brilliant inventions. Who says one must sacrifice youth for wisdom? <laughs> Moropolis security breach. Outsiders detected. <sighs> Could it be? 
two children, six robots. The meddlesome time travelers have returned. Capture those robots. Whatever powers them apparently powers my time machine. Once I extract their energy source, the reign of Morocco will stretch across the centuries. As for the children, make certain no one ever sees them again. Many more brilliant inventions follow. Can we and jump ahead to 1939? <sighs> 1939. World renowned innovator Dr. Thaddeus Morocco made his indelible imprint on this island by inventing the Moore Bot. Dither? Credited with commencing an era of technological prosperity, Morbot version 1.1 literally put Moropolis on the map. That's what went wrong. We'd left Dither behind. And Dr. Morocco pilfered his technology. So Doc Morocco built an empire from one household service bot? And we made it possible. It is often said all that is necessary for evil to triumph is for rescue bots to trample the time-space continuum. I, I paraphrase, of course. <clears throat> Perhaps someone else would care to present our history? No, because your history's wrong. Guys, we have to go back to 1939, rescue Dither, and restore Griffin Rock. Someone's coming. Oh, more unscheduled visitors. That does it. This docent is off duty. Dad! Am I glad to see you? Young man, I think you're mistaken. What? It's me, Dad. Cody. I don't have a son named Cody. And what's the idea of bringing robots in here? Do you know what their metal feet do to my floors? You really don't know who I am? Maybe I do. Citizen alert. The outsiders are in the Hall of Inspiration. <laughs> Immobilize! Stay behind us. Immobilize? They're just children. Are you all right, sir? What kind of robots are you? The good kind. I'm sorry about turning you in. We were told your machines were dangerous. I assumed you'd be detained, not attacked. Citizen alert. The outsiders have fled west on Lake Street. Thanks. We need to get back up the hill to the time machine. I don't know anything about a time machine, but you won't get far as long as the Morbots are hunting you. I know a place you can hide until things quiet down. Attention! Moropolis is in lockdown. Submit to all searches. Harboring outsiders is a crime. Clear the streets. <laughs> You wrecked my taxi! Ugh. Why didn't I listen to Mother and pursue broadcast journalism? <laughs> Businesses are to remain closed. Right away! Please don't smash my tables again! <laughs> Chief Burns. Oh. Allowing me to take the wheel would free you up to monitor the streets. Your vehicle's very intuitive and polite. Thank you, sir. You and I do make a good team. Team? Why aren't we just taking the tunnels to the firehouse? Morocco's been sealing them up, afraid of a rebellion. Wants us all above ground where he can keep an eye on us. How do you know I live in a firehouse? I know a lot about you. 
and Cade and Graham and Danny. A family of heroes, as you are affectionately known. Heroes? <laughs> I don't think so. Burns Auto Repair? You're a mechanic, too? Uh, kids are. Hanging around machines all day is not my thing. No offense. None taken. I'm worried about Optimus and Bumblebee. Don't be. They're used to working behind enemy lines. Charles Burns. I've long suspected he and his family were part of the rebellion. And they could succeed if they used those robots against me. Or those. Uh, seriously? <laughs> Alien Autobots and alternate histories? A third brother? I have enough of those already, thanks. I believe them. It explains a lot, like why Morocco's combing the island for them so aggressively. Dad, you have to know how dangerous this is, right? Yeah, drawing this kind of attention, harboring outsiders... Especially considering what we've been working on. Look, we'll be out of your garage as soon as the street's clear and we can move across town. <sighs> In the meantime, I imagine a couple of time-traveling kids could use a little food and rest. giant lobster balloon dragged Daddy into the sky. Cade rescued him using Heat Wave's ladder. <laughs> I did? Well, not that I'm surprised. Or believe any of this. Then Doc Green made this floatium gas, and real flying lobsters swarmed the town. They went after the mayor, and Graham and Boulder saved him. Whoa, who'd have thought? Danny and Blades were scooping flobsters out of the air. Me and a helicopter? <laughs> I don't even like flying. <laughs> hmm. I don't believe there's a Doc Green on this island. I wish there was. Place would be a lot more fun. Don't worry, Frankie. Your dad probably just lives somewhere else. I'm sure you'll see him again. Proceed. Downstairs, hurry! Mr. Burns, I'll make this simple. Hand over the robots, or there will be dire consequences. You have 30 seconds. We can hide in the bunker. No, Morocco knows about it. We'd just be trapped. How did you know about it? I told you, I grew up here. They've walled us in. Our apologies, Chief. It was not our intent to involve you. We don't want you to get hurt, so we'll turn ourselves in. You we can't! We won't let you! Morocco can't be trusted. He'll take you, and then he'll come after us anyway. Now, this is exactly why bringing outsiders in here was a mistake. Was it? We talk about standing up to that tyrant Morocco, but we never do. Maybe a little push is just the thing we need to bring heroes back to this town. Dad's right. We're as ready as we'll ever be. Well, if we're gonna do this, let's do it right. Meet the mobile headquarters, everyone. Big enough to hold a band of rebels. Or four rescue bots. No! Oh, bring the house down. But the robot's power source had better be salvageable.
Brace for impact. Dispatch every Morbot on the island. I'm not used to being a passenger. It's kind of relaxing. Hang on! Plan. We split up. Agreed. Six targets are statistically more challenging to hit. Make that seven. We'll use the MHQ as a decoy. Here comes Morocco! Rescue bots, roll out! Yeah, I like the sound of that. They're separating. Go after them. All of them! Please consider this an example of how not to operate a motor vehicle. It's blades. And don't worry, a very good pilot showed me how to do this. That was awesome! They're getting away! Sentries! Sentries! Guard that temporal station at all costs! We must move quickly. Sorry to leave you with such a mess. Once you go through that time machine and fix the past, everything here will change too. It's changed already. And if I had to have another brother? I wouldn't mind it being you. Take the MHQ. I have a feeling it might come in handy someday. Treat her with care, buddy. Okay? We will. See you all soon. I hope. Let's go, team. Well, you're no transforming robot, but you'll do quite nicely. Property reacquired. But where? How did you? Ready?
Dad! <gasps> Daddy! Oh, Cody, we've been so worried. You won't believe what we had to do to get back here. <laughs> Welcome home, Squirt. Can't wait to hear all about it. Time traveling. I'm pretty jealous. I missed you more than you'll ever know, Daddy. Trust me, my little Einstein. I know. Thank you for bringing our kids home safely. Mission accomplished. Why are you still talking like that? Everybody knows you're... Oh, oops. Do you mean there's more to these rescue bots than meets the eye? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Chief filled me in. With your lives at stake, keeping secrets any longer just didn't seem necessary. Optimus, Bumblebee, we're forever in your debt. Bumblebee is correct. We simply assisted the rescue bots. Thanks to you, they have become an outstanding team. One it has been an honor to serve with. Us too. Okay, so what was Dr. the Dr. 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 One thing's for sure. We're smashing that time machine. A rig this size could come in handy. Who built her? A family of heroes. Mm -hmm.